Oh, hello everybody, welcome back to the Aqua Dream Soapbox. I still have Modern Voice, and today we will be doing No Fancy Gimmicks. Today on the Soapbox we talk about my recent emergence on Twitch, the fact that I've somehow reinvigorated this love for streaming, and why that has turned out to be the case. More on that later on. I suppose let's kick this off with a bit, with a bit of context. A, a month or two back I was talking to Slayer and Sid, and they were like, hey, probably stream more, you know, try it again, it should be fun. And at the time I was already standoffish, like, nah, it doesn't do it for me anymore. I don't, I don't have that. And you know, they, they gave me some pointers as to what was working and what wasn't. Most notably Buttsbot being fucking shit. <laughs> um, but you know, I took some time and went, maybe I need to, maybe I should try this again. And even back a week ago, I kind of was still scoffing at the, at the idea. I'm like, nah, there's no way this is possibly a thing again. Except I've streamed for 15 hours in the last week. <laughs> and that is, uh, honestly, that's a big achievement for me. For I, by the end, turned to that guy who's like, okay, I'll do about an hour and a half and then I'm fucking leaving. Because I managed to, and what I figured out to be, I built a big mental barrier. I'm very bad at just doing things because I want to do things. I need some reason, I need like, like, I need a reason to do things. I don't know, it's like some anxiety block that helps try prevent me from freaking out or something. So, you know, if, 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 if I speak to you on a regular thing, it's usually because we're doing something rather than just chatting, because that, I'm like, oh god, brain! <laughs> so it's a weird uh, coping mechanism. And you know, it's not personal to any other people. Well, I don't like you. If I'm spending time with you, it means you're pretty fucking good, so, you know. Get that as a notch on your fucking belt. Um, so yeah. Essentially, I realised that it's okay to sit there for three hours. It's okay to just let things be. You can't force anything. Which I think was what I wanted to do. I wanted to force things. I wanted to force alerts. I wanted to force people being there. I wanted to force conversation. But ultimately, I wasn't in the right state of mind to be doing that as of last time. But I've been having a lot of fun. I've been having a great time streaming Jet and Will, you fuckers. Fantastic. Like, holy shit. I can't believe I slept on all this. It's nonsense. How did I manage to talk myself out of doing this? And it also helps. I've suddenly went, huh, I don't actually mind speedrunning Simpsons Hit and Run at the minute. You know, I've been practicing. I've PB, technically. So. Just everything that I've been saying for so long, like, nah, it's not happening, shit, nah, it's not happening, I'm not good for it. It's all just turning out a bit wrong, and a bit misled. And I think that's a big, that's a big thing. Even doing this, I like doing this too, this lighting is fucking awful, holy shit, can I get some, like, I'm just, I'm sorry to everybody who I deprived of this, but I think, I think my necessary time out was worth it to find the other things that I like to do. But, you know, I'm a big, big pro CS fan. So, uh, I like Count Strike. I like watching pros play it. I like watching teams play it. You know? I like that general vibe. I don't like how toxic that shit is, because, oh boy. <laughs> but, you know, I've, I took that time to improve myself, figure out where I'm at, figure out how I feel, and figure out what I actually want to do. And turns out that it's pretty fucking good. You go through stages of things, you don't really realise what the issue is, and now that the issue is somewhat solved, I can kind of do it without any real burden. I don't know why I built up such a distaste for streaming in general. I guess I was just really burnt out. And it definitely holds up to all the things I've said and my explanations as to why. Oh yeah, here's, you know, just another uh, small episode of the Soapbox 
progressing. Yeah. Yeah, it's the thing. Uh, if you want to hop on the train again, if you want to gonna feel like I may still be here within a month uh, feel free because at this point this is the time where I can at least deliver the most somewhat quality assurance hands up I don't know how long it'll last I'm not making any big grandiose plans I'm not promising the world but now I'm just promising I'll be live for about three hours at a time probably speed running Simpsons so that is what you're here for, which ultimately that's what 90% of my following is here for. Have fun. Indulge. Enjoy. It's your time now. You've waited this long. May as well come out the woodwork. May as well fucking kick the door down. Get back in and enjoy. Because it's me, somewhat motivated, enjoying the game and being ready to interact with everyone. I'm starting the stream going, man, I want to talk to people. Rather than going, oh, I guess I'll fucking stream and I'll stream for about an hour and a half. Like, come on now. And I'm sorry for everybody who had to sit through that. Because it must have just been shit. It's like, wow. Aqua is just so... He just doesn't want to do this. But no one was stopping me doing it at the time. Because I wouldn't fucking let anyone. Because like, no, I'm fine. I'm enjoying it. The only jokes is me at that time, but hopefully things will be different for now. And uh, yeah, I think that's it for me. I just want to shout out Piggy. Piggy and uh, Thunder. I hope you've both been enjoying it, specifically. You've been giving me some nice little comments, nice little feedback. Thank you, thank you. Uh, the people's bitch might say some slightly questionable things, but you know, he's a pig. What can you say? I suppose since this is going out today, may as well wish Tilbert a happy birthday as well. Not sure if Tilbert will see this, but if he, if you do, this one's for you, baby. Drink some energy drink and wine mixed, and get absolutely shit faced. Enjoy your day. <laughs> oh yeah, that's it for episode four of the Soapbox. I've been Aqua Dreams. This has been the Aqua Dream Soapbox. Join us next time. I suppose before we end this, may as well just say. I don't know what the schedule is going to be like with this. Uh, the first week I did three. Uh, this week I've done two. And we'll see, honestly. It just depends if there's interesting shit to talk about. Because, you know, the first week there was fucking Blizzard and the dickhead trying to open jar to seduce women. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's easy. That's easy shit. If there isn't anything you'd like me to talk about on the soapbox or have anything to show me and think I'd have some funny reaction, go ahead, do it in the comments, message me, do whatever. And it might be featured on another episode of the soapbox. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you next time and I'll probably see you on a stream at some point in the near future. Thank you all for watching. You'll see me on a stream in the near future. But what I was trying to say is maybe it'll be consistent. Maybe I'll fall off in a month, but if not, we've had a fucking excellent time in the meantime. Thank you for watching. I've been Aqua. This is my soapbox. Join us next time for whatever the fuck I was going to talk about. Bye bye.